Hi there YouTube, it's the Samuel Beer here and this is the Airzone Twin Tech 10 review. Woohoo! Woohoo! But anyway, um, as I said in my video I put up a couple of days ago, I will be doing an Airzone Twin Tech 10 review soon. So here it is. Now, we'll start off with the goods. Let's talk about the yellow one. Some of the goods, well, it's easy reload. Look, like if you shoot and your bullet's there, you just gotta go like this, you just gotta go, oh no, and then put that in, and you can do that. Um, it's uh, not just that about the reloading, this is quite easy to do, like to get it ready to shoot. Um, you just have it like that, or whatever. Doesn't matter if it's a full barrel, but I've lost a load of darts. And then you just gotta go like this. And as you might have noticed, then the barrel can twist. So like if you've got a bullet there, say, and you're like, oh no, oh no, you can just go like this. Yeah. Which is which is good. Um, the trigger, you don't really have to pull back kind of far up. Which, that, that's pretty good as well. And the, the barrel rotates every time you pull this back. So watch. Which is, which, that's quite cool. Um... Uh, another good thing is uh, the accuracy is sort of alright uh, and you can shoot quite far with it but we'll talk about the bads about that um, in in the bad part section thing uh, and which we're going on to now by the way so the bads um, the, the bads are uh, the bullets, they don't always go that far. Like, so, sometimes you might just go, and it'll go quite far. Or, you'll just go like, and it might not go very far. It might only go about, I don't know, maybe that far. Sometimes that's what happens with mine. Um, it's kind of heavy for a pistol. Um, which, which is sort of a bad thing. Uh... And it depends on how far about the bullets, how, like, what you do with this. You can either go like that, and you've got a better chance of it going further, or you can go like that, like you might do with a Nerf gun, and it might not go as far. But it just depends. That that's I don't know what it's like for any other uh, Airzone Twin Tech 10 ones, but... Um... You know... So yeah, and there's a, the, the accuracy thing that I was going to say about, if you're trying to shoot me in the face, you couldn't really see down it that well, because you've just basically got a little line that you can use where this has been put together, and a tiny little lump on there, that one that my finger's touching. So, yeah. Um, it does look cool, I think, which is quite good, I feel like that. Not bad for moving. So yeah. And uh, now, on to the ranks. Airzone Twin Tech 10. Type, spring slash pullback. Distance, 6. Weight, 6. Accuracy, 5. Rank, 7. So there you go, there are the, uh, are the racks, and now we can do the firing test, woohoo, right then, we'll do one gun, then the other, and you might get to see what I mean about the poor firing thing, so I'll just put one gun down first, make sure it's loaded. Right, first gun. Let's go. Okay, holding it straight. 
back a little. So that went about the length of my bedroom, and my my bedroom is uh, used to be the garage of our house. So you can imagine how long that that would be. It's quite long, my bedroom. Right, let's try this one, the yellow one. Right, so that's where the last one landed. Uh, let's just step back to as far back as we can go, because I've got a draw. Right. Holding it straight. Three, two, one. And that went. No, I saw where that landed. That landed about there. So, yeah. So the first bullet lands there, the second bullet lands there. So it's, it's quite good. I'll try one more time and see how well we do. Um, I'll try with the green one this time. And see what happens about... The problem of it not going as far as it could. Right, let's see, shall we? Holding it straight. Three, two, one. And I see that didn't go as far, it only went down there. So the first time we should do it went there, then there, then there. So not bad overall for the Airzone Twin Tech 10. Keep an eye out for my movie. Should be coming up in a, um, maybe a month or two. Uh, because I started last weekend, you see. So, yeah. And uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye.